But we start with breaking news. Police are investigating three deaths at two homes in northeast Albuquerque right now. And it appears they are connected. News 13's Tina Jensen is live near Candelaria in Louisiana with the latest developments. Tina. Dean, this is the scene of the second investigation. You can see detectives are out here still on scene. Police were called out here on Indiana Street just a few hours ago. Someone called 911 to report a woman found lying in the backyard with blood everywhere. First responders confirmed she was dead, and that's when someone at the scene noticed a possible gas leak and said someone may have tried to set the home on fire. Previously, I heard sirens, and I didn't think anything of it. I thought maybe they were pulling somebody over on the main street. And um, then uh, one of the, I think it was like engine 13 or ladder 13 drove by, and you don't really see the big fire trucks drive by. And I was like, oh, well, something happened. Other investigation on Palo Duro near Comanche. Police believe this could be related to another investigation on Palo Duro near Comanche and San Mateo. Someone saw smoke coming from a home there, and when investigators first arrived, they found two men dead inside. They'd been shot. Police say they appear to be a father and a son. Neighbors say they were around the ages of 60 and 90. Now, police have not said what the possible connection could be between these three victims. They also haven't said if they believe there's a suspect still out there. Back to you. Tina, thank you. Be sure and stay with News 13 at KRQE.com for new developments in this investigation. And, of course, we'll have the latest coming up tonight at 10.